wrong. They just uh, enjoying the process. Yeah, I, I mean boot camp wise. That uh, yeah, I mean it didn't kill anybody. It, I would say it's hard, but everybody trying hard and everybody just uh, helping each other to make, to make it easier for each other and uh, giving us a lot of energy. Did you warn them to get there on time? Uh, yeah, definitely, because uh, that's the main thing. We can't be late, so uh, anywhere we go, we got to be like early 10 minutes, so we talk, uh, we told uh, all newcomers come early and just be ready. What time did you get there? Any idea? Here? Yeah. Uh, like 5.30. Wow. So you got up like at 4.45, 5.00? Uh, no, nah, I mean, five, 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 twenty, <laughs> like that. Did you eat anything before? No. <laughs> <laughs> what, uh, what do you think of it overall? Do you, are you going to be glad next year when you're done with this? Uh, I mean, it's a great experience because, uh, like I say, you gotta, you gotta get us better and, uh, make us feel better and, uh, help us with the conditioning and, uh, help us win a lot of games. We haven't seen you in a while, um. Somewhere you said you lost 30 pounds. Is uh, that right? Yeah, I'm trying to stay lightweight this, this year, so it's going to help me a lot. So what do you weigh? Uh, 207. And when did you weigh 237? 227. It was like during the summer. Oh. I mean, at the end of the season, actually. Why did you decide that playing lightweight will help your game? Because uh, I feel like I'm faster with the lightweight and I'm more athletic. And it just helped me overall in the game. You feeling it? Are you noticing? Yeah, definitely. What do, you, what do you have to do, Smee, to lose that kind of weight at your side? Uh, the regiment? You know, just just look how what you eat and, uh, you know, just be professional, work out every day, take care of your body, and just know Is what you eat. I think, and drink it. There's like no sodas, just straight water every day. Is that kind of the biggest change you made? I mean, yeah. what kind of things were you eating? Were you stopping at McDonald's uh, every day kind of deal? Not or? really, but uh, like, for example, I did eat a lot of salads. I like a lot of green stuff, vegetables, so I think it's the main thing. It's going to help me a lot. So to get it straight, you said 20, not 30? Yeah, 20. Uh, what about Team Ukraine this summer? Yeah. Uh, it was it was a great experience, and, uh, you know, I always love playing for my national team. It's a great honor, and, uh, you know, it was, it was a great championship. I think you led him in scoring. Was that by design? Uh, yeah, I led him in scoring because uh, I was the leader of the team, and uh, uh you know, just everybody giving me a ball, and uh, I was trying to help my team to win, to get every possession in my hands and kill it with a pass or a shot. Did a lot of people, were they surprised back home that you didn't go pro? Uh, you know, I didn't, I didn't talk to a lot of people, so, you know, they just told me, like, do whatever is best for you, and uh, I think they think, everybody think me coming back is a great decision. How much do you think Italy helped you guys now that you're here, you know, first practice a couple weeks away, that kind of thing. Do you, do you notice that that trip did uh, good? I think it did help just uh, to become more closer as a team and uh, just to know each other better. What are your personal goals for your senior season? What are you looking to get better at? Uh, I would say the main goal is to win a national championship. That's what we're trying to do every year and uh, also win Big 12. But is there anything from a personal standpoint you're looking to improve and show? Uh, just to improve everything and uh, you know, just be a great, better player and teammate. The national championship is that something you guys talk about as a team, or is it just something that's assumed amongst you guys that that's the goal? Uh, we talk about it too because the uh, last two years uh, we were pretty close to Final Four, and uh, you know, this year we we just we just we just got to get there because we were really one step away, and we felt like we should have been there, but we didn't make it for some reason. So, can you tell you're a senior? Does coach treat you different? Uh, I would say because uh, the senior guys, he had more trust because we've been around him for four years and uh, play for him, know the chemistry, and uh, you know just been around him longer, and I uh, think he has more trust. But you know he trusts everybody the same, and uh, just got to prove it to him. What Was is today the easiest boot camp ever? Because you're a senior. Uh, not really. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> Boot camp is hard every year, and uh, like I say, just mentally, you just got mentally tough, mentally prepared. What What is that like for you to be a leader? I mean, does it does it mean louder? Does it mean more by example? I mean, I, I'm sure that's part of what you want to. Yeah, do I would say year. everything because, uh, like, I would say all the seniors, we gotta be more louder and vocal, and just help younger guys to learn quicker. And uh, you know, we help them; they're gonna help us. Did that start this morning? Who was who was the loudest in there today? Uh, I would say it was Legero, and 
Devante is pretty loud. I think everybody everybody trying to be loud and hitting for each other. Thanks, Steve. Thanks.